Well, hello, everybody. This is Lisa de Nicolette, writer for a year. And, and last night, we had an amazing event at the Annette Street Library. I've been hosting an event at the Annette Street Library uh, for the past, actually, since 2010. So I guess that's uh, nine years now. We haven't had one every year, but uh, pretty much close to every year. And last night, I decided to do something a little bit different, which was to have a salon, um, to have music and art. Um, and it was called the Salon of the Collective Creative. Creative. And uh, we had a wonderful turnout and it turned into a really fantastic evening with the synergy of all the artists working together and it was really fantastic. And because she let herself go, decided when she would go, not to care anymore, to no longer withstand the pain, the guilt, the loss, all the naysayers in her life and inside her own head. I had, well gee, thanks mom. <laughs> her words made me sorry that she didn't need oatmeal. But while she had rejected me, she'd never hurt me as badly as my father had. And of course I'd known about the tendency on my father's side for heart failure at a young age. And in fact, I'd been counting on that. I contemplated what I was going to talk about tonight, and uh, I, was, you know, I was looking up quotes and you know, beauty and nature, and there's so much that's been written. And I feel like tonight has been the perfect setup um, to change a little bit about what I wanted to, you know, share with you, which is that our relationship with beauty is complicated. Eagle, no one barking upon the soundless foam, cockpits moaning pirate stately, disembodied voice of liquid, speckled, philosophic stone, arising from out of the tender, sealskin boats of our cold gray sailors, incestuous mother odd. By her one color painting, at the center of the edge, the dead coarse peasants, the dead coarse peasants, rebel Chinese along the river, labors, millions. Only, only the vampires escape black country rock unscathed. The home for the funeral, I put flowers on his grave and I stood by my mother's side while the priest prayed for my father's soul. And I wondered if, in his dying moments, my father realized that he'd been killed by his dirty little girl. And I certainly hoped so. What happens if you throw a wrench into that and something is asymmetrical or imbalanced? Does it shift your relationship with that particular thing at its most basic level? And sweet. One, the call shattered my voice, raised at least a couple notes, ringing like a chain through a loop to congratulate you on the unexpected. I'd affixed hopes to this embattled ship, this horse that wouldn't jump its gate. I feel like the last woman on earth who wants to be the last of her lineage. Kiss, French kiss, French kiss, foam flung from a deep ship's voice. New kingdoms for haggard pariahs like me to seek. New ways to manipulate public opinion to accept the agendas of the ruling classes. Fresh symbols. New ways to burn out. New raptures to defile a thine body, drifting toxic clouds of volcanic ash. Yes, you 
you know See that look As you tighten up your robe 